Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen, and everyone watching. I'm your host, The Report of the Week, and thank you for tuning in uh, to this newest video. Uh, now, most importantly, I wanted to give a bit of an update and a recap, kind of, as to what went down over the last few days, because, needless to say, it was, it was quite crazy, uh, quite unexpected, and I uh, just... Oh, overall, very scary situation, but at the same time, extremely lucky at that. Uh, what happened was, I, I unfortunately took a very, very hard fall, and wound up in the hospital as a result. I was doing some work in the attic, and, and this was on me. I should, I should mention that. It was just a mistake on my part, and <laughs> guaranteed will never happen again. But I was doing some work in the attic, and uh, when I lost my footing and fell, and uh, fell about 12 feet onto a very hard floor, but I think it was concrete, uh, there was nothing to break my fall, and I fell first on my uh, tailbone, and then the back of my head kind of slammed onto the, the ground, too. And so needless to say, it was uh, very, very scary. Went to the hospital and uh, was checked out. Most importantly, should be mentioned that, you know, I'll, I'll recover from this. You know, it, it's gonna take a while, and, you know, it'll, it'll be what it'll be, but I'll get through it, and, uh, you know, it, it could have been so much worse. Most importantly, there were no severe brain injuries, which is, which is just, it's incredible. Uh, it was just so scary what happened, you know, there's been a lot of pain, and, of course, in, in a lot of uh, different parts of my body, and then I also got cut up with some nails that kind of dragged along my back as I was going down, and then I guess my mouth slammed shut, and I bit a lot of my tongue, and uh, just a whole nice little, uh, you know, variety of, of various injuries I sustained. Um, but the good news is that there's nothing life-threatening, and uh, I'll be able to fully recover and I'll be back in tip-top shape and in full working order, um, you know, in no time, really. So that, that's, that's the really good news here. Uh, it, was, it was really scary, uh, and it was a really hard impact. Um, but I, I, I'm just so glad and, and so thankful because it, it could have been so much worse. You know, falls are, are one of those things that uh, the, the levels of severity... Uh, it, it, it all depends on how you land and how how you fall, what you land on, and so on and so forth. And that, that very fall could have, could have been very, very different in regards to its outcome. Uh, had, had I even just landed a little differently, and it was just really scary. So I, it, was, it was extremely uh, unanticipated, needless to say. It's, uh, it was just so crazy. But at the same time, more than anything else, I'm, I'm just so... Th because I know it could have been so much worse. It could have been so much worse. It, it, it could have been fatal if I had, you know, hit the... Hit the certain areas, you name it, it, it could have easily been. So, I'm just so glad that despite the pain and all of that, uh, you know what, I'll be able to recover. I'll, I'll be back at it as usual soon enough. And uh, the fact that have been so much worse but it wasn't it's just it, it's so incredible that's the best way to put it and one thing that really shocked me that that really just blew me away was after i you know made the initial announcement as to what happened the response from from you guys the community was just it blew me away it was incredible i i, I never anticipated never expected such a response so i just most sincerely wanted to thank each and every one of you for your support, for your kind words, uh, your thoughts. Th thank you all so much. Uh, it just, it, it really means a lot to me, and I, I just never expected so much. It's, an, it's just, it's incredible. But thank you all so much, and I just want to keep you all updated as to how I'm doing, what's going on, and really just thank you so much for just your outpouring of kindness. It's just, it's incredible. Truth be told, so thank you. And uh, one thing that I did want to show you, um, because I know I explained the situation, I know I explained 
what happened, how I fell. Of course, I could go into more detail, but, uh, you know, I, I explained the gist of things, at least the bare basics. Uh, I did, I did want to just show you a short video. I just, I was able to film kind of where I fell just to put it into better perspective. So take a look and uh, then I'll, I'll be back in a minute. All right. Well, like I said, I wasn't joking when I, when I told you that I fell. <laughs> yeah. Needless to say, I was, I was not. Uh, here I am in the garage. It's one of those attics that's above the garage there, for better reference. You know, it's one of these that you just pull this thing and, you know, then the little staircase will go through and I'll have to get a floor put there or something. But needless to say, you can see it was my mistake. It was, you know, I, I messed up. But for reference, you know, I was trying to get to that board there and you know, I kind of, I misjudged my step. That's what happened. And my foot slipped. So did I, of course. And then with that, uh, I fell down from there uh, onto the ground here. And, I mean, you can see, I mean, <clears throat> is what it is. Uh, but you can see, though, let me get the autofocus off. It's, uh, it's solid ground. There's nothing to cushion my fall, and you can <clears throat> see all the crap that fell down there with me. Um, but this is where my head landed, right around here. Again, just on uh, solid ground. And uh, so that's how I fell. That's how it was. You can see just for storage. I was up there, then I just fell. I guess I was kind of moving forward and then I kind of fell back, <laughs> fell back down like that. Then right around there is probably where my back and tailbone landed and then here was where my head whipped back. And then, you know, the rest of me was all here. And uh, the other thing worth showing, likewise, is, I don't know how long you can see, all right there, those were all the nails that got me too. Um, because needless to say, when you're falling and all of your weight is kind of going down those, <laughs> to, to, as a little bit of an understatement, they uh, kind of left a mark, needless to say. But yeah, that, so that's where I fell and that's how it happened. And that's, that's the fun story. Yeah, what a fall that was, truth be told. It was, it, it, it was insane. Um, but, you know, I'm, I'm taking care of myself. I've got my water right here in the infamous blue chalice. Able to get my coffee intake right there. Uh, vegetable intake right there with the with the V8. But, no, it, it does. It's, it's got a lot of good stuff in it. And then, of course, the uh, absolute essentials of any good recovery. I've got my chicken biscuits from Chick-fil-A, which I'll, I'll show you why not. <laughs> you know, they're, they're good. They're tasty. And granted, uh, because my tongue is all bit up, I can't necessarily enjoy them to their fullest, but they're still good. They still taste good, and... Uh, they're still just as good as I remember them. You know, it's, the fall did not change my perception of chicken biscuits. They're always a good, a good little breakfast snack. Best way to put them, you can see, right there for verify verification purposes. Right there, see, it's not a prop chicken biscuit. It's a real one. And I'll take. A, I'll, I'll. I'll even go ahead and take a little bite for you. Why not? And the good news, at least, is despite <laughs> biting my tongue a bit, I didn't knock out any of my teeth, so that's good. So, even though, uh, you know, I'm, I'm glad, I'm glad. That's one of the first things, uh, I remember just for the heck of it, checking with my tongue, but there was no, no missing teeth, so that, that's, that's good anyway. But, 
No, I'm, I'm, you know, taking it easy, uh, resting, you know, t just taking it easy, giving, uh, giving my body a, a break, best way to put it, but, no, I'm staying, I'm staying hydrated, staying fed, uh, you know, taking care of myself, have a wonderful person helping as well, and, uh, you know, I just wanted to really make this video to, you know, give an update, uh, let everyone know how things are going, what exactly happened, and uh, just let you know, look, uh, it was crazy, it was very intense, but in the end, I got extremely lucky. Things will get better, and, uh, you know, no matter what, I, I certainly learned my lesson number one to just, you know, to be able to watch my step, watch where I'm going, you know, more, uh, more carefully, best way to put it. But also, one very important thing that was just reinforced for me, uh, you know, with, with all that happened here, uh, just not to take life for granted. Things could have, could have changed so, so horribly with what happened that day. And uh, the fact that I, I emerged so lucky from this, you know, not to take it from granted, things can change at any moment, but just goes to show how fragile things can be. But I'm really, really thankful that I, I made it out, uh, you know, in, as, well, in, in pretty much one piece, and uh, I'll be around for, for much longer, which is great. And I also just wanted to finish it up by saying once again, thank you so much for your support. I'll be keeping you updated going forward. Um, you know, before you know it, we'll see when the next video comes out, but we'll get something, we'll get something coming up when it comes up. And, uh, before you know it, I'll be back at it again with, uh, reviews and other videos. And, uh, until then, I just want to keep you posted, keep you updated. Thank you for watching and thank you for your support. I'm your host, The Report of the Week, and take care.